And we're back. Wander, you want to give us an intro? You want to explain I mean, what's going on here? I mean, I see robot boobs, ro robo nipples. Michelle, no, why no, are there no. robo nipples here? Explain, <laughs> explain to us what the story is right now. Explain. Um, to, tell us. Tell us. Okay, show us how much you've so been paying attention. We we are a random <laughs> home invader. This may or may not be our home. It was never clearly defined. We just kind of walked into our house. Or we're already in this house. I don't actually remember. Um. But there was a note from somebody being like, I'm not going to be back, but please make soup for the bird. And so you make soup for the bird. Wait, no, this is our house because we had the, like, buried stuff. But Yeah. Th there was dialogue, though, that made it seem like it was contrary. Like, this might not be our house. Let's, like, it's the more character... like we don't seem to know what's going We don't seem to know who we are. Yeah. Now, which what's is the bizarre. significance of the 74, 33, and 26? We have no clue. No, Those I know. look like flowers. It's this thingy. Things how you scan people's biogenetics or whatever, oh, yeah. and it gives yeah, you a their, score. Their bio score. But it's, yeah, so we make soup for the bird, and then then we're like, maybe we should switch on this robo chick that's just sitting around here because <laughs> we have nothing better to do with our our lonely selves. And then we did. So what's our current objective? Uh, we need to go fix our eyes. Yeah. Somebody decided to break them. And who is the strange voice? Oh yeah, Shell's joining us because why not? It's Shell from, well, a bunch Multiple of stuff on the channel, series. or from my WoW series. Because you remember yeah. WoW, right? All of you new people that weren't here four months ago last time I uploaded an episode. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's like, that was Whoops. before I was at a thousand uh, subscribers. Jeez. Were it not for the subscription fee, I would definitely go back to that. We're hearing some sort of chime in the background over and over again. Mm-hmm. Oh, yep, that's the cable Whoa. car. There's yeah. just a straight up cable car over there. Like, actually landed for um, us. Hop right in. I bet he sounds like that. <laughs> yep, there's a driver. That's a driver. I'm sure he's friendly. What, uh, what you know are what? you? He, he's Probably probably like, going to demand that we, we bring him a shrubbery <laughs> or something. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's got that cart. I'm just banking on it now. So he's a robot body. Yeah. Just like the girl is, but he's got the cartoonish disguise on his face. Yeah, he's <laughs> got like a the nose mark and eyebrows. Disguise. But the and rest then he's of also is just got a, a robot beard. body. He's got a beard underneath it, though, which is the glorious part. This Wait. is fantastic. All right, kill him and st take his eyes. It must be his mine. Funny glasses. That would be a source of a lens. It is creepy how that's just an a that's a fully filmed like someone's face. The eyeballs. Yeah, mm -hmm. that is it disconcerting. Did, it, didn't, it didn't look quite that much like just straight up video footage with a girl, but here it's like clearly just some dude on a webcam. Well, where'd you disappear to? Listen, I found out how much they're paying. It's good money. Very good, actually. I'm going tomorrow. The procedure is simple. No pain and almost no damage. Sure, your brain is a little worse for wear while their patient recovers, but a job's a job, right? I might even quit the whole flower collecting business. But all that's still just castles in the sky. In the meantime, we've got phytocopies to sell. I got an order for you, so listen up. Two red, 70 at the least, one orange. Um... Sorry, I don't know what that means. Who are you? Anibish, I ain't got time to spare, so why are you wasting it? Tabaha is gonna get fired. I don't want to go back to getting shut down for 20 days in a month span. I lost my memory, Tabaha. What are phytocopies? If this is a joke, it's a real dumb one. Tell me what phytocopies are. And why we sell them. Cut the crap. What do you mean, why sell them? Because people buy them. HQ goods are valuable. Somebody beautiful can license a copy of their DNA and sell it, which can then be used to make all sorts of stuff. Androids, flower vases, like the one on your table. Ask why don't you collect the flowers yourself? Are you mocking me? I've had enough of that. My head still ain't right after the last time. You're the weirdo around here, strolling right alongside the enclosure without any harm. I'm just an old, miserable outsider, pretty damn useless, too. Then again, I'll be healing beautiful folks soon. Guess there's some use left in me yet. Heal them from what? I told you, their emotions are all gone. They walk around like zombies, blinking vacantly. Treatment is in full swing. Donors are needed. Donors of what? What else? Immunity. Turns out the elite are more susceptible to panic. 
some kind of burnout in their heads. So that's what happened. Emotional burnout in all the beautiful folk. Now they need their immunity to panic restored. But that immunity needs to come from somewhere, right? And who is it that endures panic best? Who are you going to turn to? I don't know. The uglies? Bingo! But see, nearly all the uglies have been put to sleep. So now they're being woken up. Fine, Tabaha. So, you want me to pick some flowers? No, damn it, not pick some flowers. If you go and pick the first flowers you see, feel free to stuff them right up your nostrils. Who's going to buy those? What I need is the prettiest flowers you can find. I'm not really an expert on aesthetics. Amazingly, today you're even weirder than usual. Look, you take the genometer, go up to the flowers and measure their beauty. I need two red gabaras with a 70 HQ or higher, no lower. One orange, 80 or higher, and one yellow, 90 or higher. Make sure to measure only fully open flowers, else the phytocopier will jam up and cleaning it is a pain. Aim at the center of the flower, lest it close up before you're done major. Once picked, digitize it with the phytocopier, then pack everything. Pack into what? Same as always, into a box of covers. All right, that sounds doable. I'll be back in three hours. What do you want for the job? Want me to bring back food? I need a lens for a female embody. A lens won't help that vase of yours. It was already barely functioning when your late grandfather bought it up in buying Hangkor. Ain't nothing you can do. It's a cheap, pirated copy. Let it go. It's been gathering dust for years, so let it. Bring me the lens, Tabaha. Fine, I'll bring it. But I want you to know that you're slowly losing your marbles out here. You should move to the city. I'll be sure to do that. Just one more question. Shoot. What is that number on your chest? What does it mean? Ha! <laughs> Good one. Seriously, I didn't see it coming. All right, I'm off. Tons to do and the weather is getting nasty. Get yourself a hat. A warm one, made of fur. Know what I'm talking about? Well, he's friendly. <laughs> Alright, bye. Weird space bus. Wow, so... The elite have worried themselves into nothingness, and they need the memories of past objects from, you know, the lower classes in order to create new things that are technically recreations of old things from uh, people's minds. Just plot device so they can force you to go gather flowers. Flowers! You need to find nice ones. Oh, remember, he wanted some orange and red. Yeah. Uh, yep. You probably want to go get that scanner. I assume yep. it's been wiped from your inventory, like usual. Uh, well, I don't think I picked it up. Well, it was Weren't in your some inventory of those flowers originally. Were but... back at the uh, house? There were some Prob of the open ones. Probably not enough. No, those were all like 30s. Yep, mm -hmm. 17, 33, 26. Hello, scanner. You're mine now. Do we have to go yeah. scan a bunch of things? We need uh, uh, two reds that are above 70. One orange above 80, and one yellow above 90. Luckily, they're all in this... that uh, garden area just outside of the theme park. Oh, right, the part. They're all in the uh, garden. Yeah, because you've got that, like, that set That makes of... sense. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is that... No, that's not the station, is it? Where do we leave the magical tram car? Somewhere around here. Remember, you busted through the gate. You don't even need to take oh, a magical right. tram car. You can just use them foots. Mm -hmm. You can just walk. So the numbers must know quality? I was kind of just uh, looking for a shortcut. Kind of, yeah. Let's go ahead and draw that thing. Steve All right, decided we're going to go was... look at some flowers. I threw it. Welp. <laughs> <laughs> not how you use that object. <laughs> Your value um, to society. Sheesh. Did you see where it landed? Uh, uh, oh. Wait, no, I got it. That's cool. Okay. 
And I apparently can't scan a flower if it's not fully open, even though it's clearly fully open, you liar. <laughs> no. Nope. You are, uh... Oops, I dropped it. It, it needs to be flat. You need if to you find left a flat click one. When you're, if you left click when you're slightly off from a flower, you'll just drop it on the ground. That's pretty <laughs> embarrassing, honestly. <laughs> Alright, yeah, he's pretty incompetent. Oh, these ones look flat. Love me. <laughs> <laughs> Love me. Oh god, I killed it. <laughs> I destroy This is uh... Oh I, I need to aim better next time. I did it wrong. What did I do? It Why is it why is it closing? And then the music I... began. Yeah, it got really dramatic. Like this is really a big deal. What am I aiming wrong? Maybe you weren't directly on the center? What is... Um... Um... They don't like being scanned. They're like, apparently, get your flower stuff somewhere apparently else. Apparently these flowers are shy. Come on, scan that shit. Scan it hard. 87. I need that, right? That means it's what I want, so grab it. How do I grab it? Do I use this uh, knife on it? Item doesn't work. Um, it just says pick the flowers. Uh, this is uh, gonna be an interesting episode. You know, you know how we had that whole thing about maybe I should go look up a guide. Let's go look up a specific guide for cradle and flowers. <laughs> maybe I have to click the it. Kitchen knife. But would picking the flower oh. after it's closed mean anything? Oh, I got one! This one magically didn't shit itself. Now I get to just have it. Cool. Alright, cool. Did they explain anything about how this thing works? Did I miss something in the dialogue? No, they didn't. Like I was talking for 10 minutes straight? Because it's you a little hard to one take over. Oh, didn't you? Yeah, one, yeah, well, one was good. There was one good one. But all the other ones have been closing on me, but I don't know how to stop them from closing, because if I stop scanning, it's like starting over. Reading the forums? You're doing it absolutely 100% correctly. Yep, this one arbitrarily worked. Alright, cool. This you only needed, is, this is good. You only needed two I red, like red flowers, correct? Game. Yeah, now I need one okay. orange and one yellow, but now these ones have to be... I need an orange above 80 and a yellow above... 90. <laughs> I just run around and scan stuff for five hours until the, this decides that I've won. Yeah, apparently. Yeah, this game really does have like a world and a backstory, but all the gameplay is like excuses to make you look at things and pick them or well, it's to pad the stand game out. around for a while. It's yeah. to pad the game out. There's only it's pretty... one orange in that patch. You know what this game is? You know what this game is? Alright, I need these open. Keith, this game is Dear Shenmue. Esther? We are playing Shenmue. Shenmue! What's Shenmue? I was a great forklift driver. <laughs> I was king of the forklift drivers. No one could be the boss of me. Except my boss. <laughs> Cause like, Minor from what I could tell, Shenmue was a story and then a bunch of mini games to kind of pad the game out so you actually... ...had something to do. Oh, creepy sp Gas oh, yeah. here. By the way, uh, make sure if that thing's going to hit you, that it hits you in a place. Oh, uh, actually, ditch Whoa! your scanner. Oh, shit, it caught me. Oh, oh. No. that's not good. Well, good uh, luck finding your scanner. Oh, I, f I found it. Okay, good. Yeah, if the gas monster attacks you, like there are people reporting that they can't find the scanner even after a reload. That's a bummer. I specifically tried to walk away because I was like, I th thought it was just, just going to go on its own path. I didn't know it was going to actually home in on me and chase me. Well, if the gas monster is going to attack you, just stand on one of the, um... I need two, right? On one of the edge things. Oh, I only needed one orange? Oh, wait, I haven't had one yet. Never mind. Yeah, you haven't had an orange one yet. They've all closed. Did it do? This is going to be a really exciting episode. I, I missed it in the... Nice. So, I, I'm reading... Prematurely. I'm reading the forums to see if there are any other hints on flowers, and you are doing it absolutely 100% correctly. But yeah, there's just like a lot of like weird comments about like the robot chick and like making out with her and stuff, and it's just like, uh, yeah, are you the internet's really, yeah, really creepy like that. Well, it's odd that 
you know, your everyone's like, oh, your grandfather got that. <laughs> What? Did I tell you the that base? I uh, I went into GIMP and I used uh, I used the clone stamp my thumbnail to like sort of delete the the uh, nipples. <laughs> <laughs> so I Seems used the girl as thumbnail because she's like the only on screen character basically. Yeah, and I just was like I was just like fully clone stamping out the outline of her nipples so that they're just boobs and not yeah. like creepily naked looking on my thumbnail. <laughs> Probably a good idea. I'm like, odd that just seems be... weird for a thumbnail. <laughs> I just think it's odd that she would be function as a vase. They keep referring to her as a vase. It's almost like people that get those lamps that look like a leg with fishnet stockings on them. <laughs> uh, Come on. Or they the, have the high uh, heels, too. Or the breast, the breast mugs. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, those. Like, are... The, the, I mean, I guess sippy cups. They're also ones. Sippy uh, D cups, am I right? Still don't have a fucking orange. God damn it! Oh, there we go. All I did was complain. Is... Oops, I dropped it. <laughs> Tur turns out whining is the uh, the key to victory here. Yeah, it's cool. I brought tor I brought a I brought a lighter. Oh, I dropped it. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I just want to see the world burn. I'm regretting the fact that I brought my lighter and, and my uh, knife and my flashlight out here. I'll be completely what honest. Be chances, are, chances are you're not going to be using survival. any of those <gasps> after this. I Okay, you'll see that when, you, when, you, when your stream catches up. I okay. found a use for a thing. <laughs> Ooh. Just dispel it with the light. Pretty nice. I'm just gonna hop by the town, the house, real quick, just, just to dump a few things. I wonder if the light here would do the same, or if, if it has to be in much closer proximity to dispel. Uh, or uh, I know you, you you use the lighter. I don't know if I don't know if any, if things have more than one use in this game, but uh, use the I'm, lighter and the knife when you're cooking at the beginning. I am going hmm. to assume that the knife has no use past the initial one. Just, just in I... case I ever have to cook or burn something again, I'm gonna put them back in the kitchen. <laughs> I thought I was gonna come out and be prepared, but then we got a, immediately got a mission of like, hey, hey, fill your entire inventory with stuff. I'm like, <laughs> I like it how everything yeah, takes yeah. one slot in your inventory, no matter how big it is. It's like oh, flour, same <laughs> size as nice. soccer ball. Hmm. <laughs> that always Close. bothers me in games. Close. Close. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm reasonable. Alright. Let's game. show the scanning process that here. The lighter is enormous. There we go. I, I grab one of these, right? Yeah, it's a massive lighter. It's probably because you don't want, they don't want you to lose it all the time. So I put that in there, but how do I scan it? Oh. Do I, don't have, I, don't, I guess I don't have to increase the slot. I don't have to put in a uh, slot. There's, no. There's like six items, but enough. It's a 91. Yay. Crap, I have to carry them still. <laughs> Alright. This, well, this is, is how you preserve things forever. These are the moments I like. The little texture moments of like, look how this works. It's just the, yeah. the thing they make you do first is like, oh. <laughs> they made working your job feel like working a job. <laughs> and then you're like, I got a cool sci-fi thing. This is not worth the effort I've put into it. Yeah. I'm gonna keep the flashlight around. That yeah, has an obvious that, use. That actually, yeah. Now we just need to find yellow, everyone's favorite color. Mmm. <laughs> everyone's favorite color. Nah, mine's purple. Yeah. No now, one, did you I don't, clear I don't know anyone whose space? favorite color is yellow. Yeah, yeah you I did. Put the, I put the knife and the lighter okay. in that one. It turns thing. out I wasn't I wasn't as far along on the timeline as. Uh, Shell was, because Shell was reacting to things before me, and I was like, how is this, how oh, is you this were, working? You, you were even more behind. Yeah, so <laughs> I was like some odd, like, 20 seconds, and I was just like, this seems yep. wrong. It's probably because I'm a, a good 400 miles closer to, uh, the nah, West Coast than data there. transfer doesn't account no. for that much of it. No, it's nigh instantaneous. Okay. Nigh. Like yeah. Watchmen, the end is. Oh. Yeah. We're okay, playing Keith. that if you if we're, if we're ever local again, we're playing Watchmen. 
Okay. The game's it's kind the of watch- garbage. <laughs> yeah, I can is, imagine. Is that kind but of Watchmen? A, but it's a it's a but it's a co-op. It's a it's a top-down co-op brawler. Oh only. boy. A two and it's a two episode game. You play as you play as Night Owl and Rorschach. Pretty great. Great. It's actually, that an okay game. Great. It's, it's actually it's fairly fun. It tries to take place like in the old days before uh, the superheroes stopped existing, basically. Oh, that's actually kind of nice. As part of the company, it was like he was going to go be a day laborer or something oh. like that. Oh. Mm. Fuck you. I got a completed oh. scan of 25. <laughs> That's our first completed scan ever. Of a yellow. No. Oh, yellow. It's our first ever completed scan of this color, and it magically is. What? Is that how I do that? Was that what I've been doing wrong this whole time? Do I have to stand like... Don't... Does that magically... Is like getting in the middle of the areola thing or whatever for the whole time, like... Maybe it allows you to uh, scan it for longer? Oh, oh my god! There's a secret. There's a secret. So straddle the flower and uh, then it will love you better. That would have been good to fucking know. Here's my fucking flower. We, we could have... We could Fuck have you. Passed. Stuck the, the perfect flower. Fuck. <laughs> so, fun fact: you know all those closed flowers? They're not even 3D. They're just 2D uh, images. Yeah. Yeah, they like are. Little, yeah, I've been I've been definitely tulips. noticing that. So I have a somewhat higher detail perspective of the of the view. So I've been abundantly aware that they're just 2D pixels. Yep. All of that. Yeah. Apparently, there's a magical secret where if you aim it perfectly in the middle like standing directly score. above it then that makes it not freak out all right now that, point that here i'm like going to i'm something. going to roll the footage back all up. the way to the beginning of this mess and see just where where they told us to straddle the flower and uh get a better scan as a result well i think at one point they might have hinted the like you need anything? to aim this better a bit or something when I, the first time i fucked up like it wasn't like that we didn't get a detailed explanation, but that's how the whole game has been too, is every time we do anything, it's like, all right, go get the dried roots. The fact and that like, the we just get steps with no context. Is, like, yeah, I don't, I don't know even what that know why even the means. flowers have to close. You could easily just, I mean, I suppose that's so that you don't return to the same flower again and again. But if all the flowers open back up, after you scan, it doesn't make sense. Eureka! I hate my life. Pack the phytocopies into the box. Hello, box. A uh, big obvious box for phytocopies. Get in there. Yeah. Mmm, dirty. Uh. Whoa. <laughs> oh. Okay. My, my box now. You're in my inventory. Alright, new objective. Give me. Give me, 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 give me. I'm trying to go fast now because we've lost so much time. Speak with that. Oh, I don't need to talk to her. She's not important to the story. I go get her lens. You know, I was thinking. I can ask Tabaha to help you with the evacuation. No, Anabish. That's a bad idea. Until I've checked the number of my neurocopy, nobody must know about me. Why is that number so important? Because I'm not sure of my authenticity. We don't know where my neurochip was before making its way to you. If I'm a duplicate, then I'll simply be arrested. At the first registration. Well, alright. It's your call. So, let's check your number. Nothing on that front either. I found a list of the amusement park's employees, but for some reason, my name isn't on it. But I'm sure I used to work here. I need more particulars about the park, anything at all. My memories are fragmented and don't tell me anything. But you remembered something, yes? Tell me. Well, I remember that all kids would undergo a transfer after the show. I don't know why. Undergo a what? A mirror transfer. That's what the procedure of transferring consciousness into a mechanical body is called. Meaning, the kids would leave the Gerbera Garden in M-bodies. 
Strange, isn't it? Doing a transfer at an amusement park. Strange is the word. And another thing. Their age. These kids were really young, around five, six at the most. What's odd about their age? They were way too young for a transfer. Little kids don't get their bodies replaced, but they did here for whatever reason. And I played some kind of role in it. Only I don't remember what it was. Maybe you'll remember more once your sight is back. Maybe. If Tabaka makes good on his promise, and if there's a functioning look screen in the park. Tell me more about this device, the look screen. Do you mean its purpose? Yes. How does this screen provide sight? A look screen doesn't provide sight. Rather, it displays an image of eyes. I think it's used in a transfer somehow, but I don't recall exactly how. I'll try to remember while you're out. I'm on my way. Which pavilion should I look in? The second. And don't forget... Don't forget what? The box with the phytocopies. Help me understand something. What? Whose eyes are on your look screen? Mine. The same eyes I was born with. The same shape and proportions. Everything is stored in the genochip, my entire DNA. Got it. <laughs> 